दिस स्मेल सो गुड आई लेट टेल यू दैट नहीं नहीं मैं अपनी तारीफ नहीं कर रहा हूँ वाकई वाकई अच्छी है A lot of you guys have been asking for me to remake one of Chef Ranvi's recipes and today we're going to be remaking his butter chicken and I have a lot of hopes that this recipe is going to be super delicious and if it is we're going to be making more recipes of his. If you haven't checked out any of the other videos that we have reviewed or our carbonara video of Jamie then be sure to do so after seeing this video and if you do happen to enjoy this one then be sure to give it a like, give it a share so more people can see it and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on any future content. Now, let's get started. Butter chicken bana raha hu. Bhai, sabse zyada searched recipe puri duniya mein pata hai kya hai? Butter chicken. Aur mujhe nahi pata tha. To maine kaha bhai ab itni zyada searched hai. To kahin na kahin to Ranveer Brar ko bhi apni recipe batani padegi na. <laughs> so I'm going to do a butter chicken recipe like how I do it, like how I learned it. Uh, और उस साथ गुलाम रसूल साहब से सीखी थी मैं आपके सामने पेश कर रहा हूँ उम्मीद करता हूँ आपको पसंद आएगी Hmm? Now this was the very first video that we had ever reviewed of Chef Ranvi and every single video that I review of his the more I like watching his videos and the more I like seeing his recipes one he explains very easily for everybody to understand very clearly and he's also quite respectful so these are some things that I like quite a bit about him and also his videos. Now like he has done, we have also pre-prepped some of our ingredients. I have sliced up some of the onions as well as the tomatoes and I've put all the different spices that we have. We have quite a bit in different little containers. So wow, it looks nicer for the videos. So in a pan, first of all, tomato, pyaaz, garlic, adrak, degi mirch, khade masalo mein thoda long, दालचीनी तेज पत्ता और काली मिर्च एंड देन बटर Right, so today we're going to be cooking with our Dutch oven. It's a little bigger and well, it'll cook a little faster. Like Chef Henry, we're going to be adding a little bit of water into the pan. I'm going to be adding the tomatoes, the onions, and all of the other ingredients as well as the spices. Also, if any of you are a little sensitive to, well, chili peppers and you can't take the heat, if you do or if you are using Deggie Mitch, I would taste a little bit before you actually add this much to the pan just to see how spicy it is, just in case, because you don't want to go through the effort of making this and then end up tasting it and it's way too hot for you. And if you're using cassia cinnamon, which has a much thicker bark to it, I won't go in about to the different ratios of the chemicals and everything, but in any case, it is a lot thicker. So if you cook with this, even after 15 minutes, you're not going to be able to really blend it up. So if you're using true cinnamon or Ceylon cinnamon, uh, this is a lot better because it's a lot more delicate and the flavor is also a lot better. I'll toss a little bit. I don't want to add color. If the color is gone, then all the work is done. Because the color that you want in the gravy is not from the browning of the onion. It's purely from the tomato and the deggi mirch. Choti lychee. Now this is the good thing about re-watching a video because sometimes you make mistakes the first time or you miss things as well. And the first time I thought he meant that you want to get some of the color from the uh, caramelization of the onions. So basically you just want to cook this until the onions are translucent and the tomatoes are super soft. And then this is a little later on in the video, but then we're going to be blending everything. Butter chicken is a lot of theories and conspiracy theories. The most common theory is that किन्हीं के यहाँ आई वॉन्ट नेम किन्हीं के यहाँ रात का तंदूरी चिकन बहुत बच जाने लगा तो उनको टेंशन होगी कि भाई दूसरे दिन अगर मैं इसको तंदूर में डालूंगा तो बिल्कुल ही सूख जाएगा तो क्या किया जाए तो उन्होंने वो रात का बचा हुआ तंदूरी चिकन कई बार हड्डी के साथ कई बार बगैर हड्डी के एक टमाटर के सॉस में डालना शुरू कर दिया और फिर बाद में उसको क्योंकि चिकन सूखा होता था उसको रिचनेस देने के लिए उसके अंदर थोड़ी मलाई One other thing I like about Chef Ranvi's videos is that he always gives little tidbits or little history lessons in his videos, which like this, if you didn't know the history of butter chicken, it is very helpful because butter chicken is a relatively new dish that has recently been invented and it's tasty, but there are many other dishes as well that are also very tasty, Indian dishes. I'm going to add water. After adding water, it's a little bit of butter. बटर चिकन है यार डाल दे रणवीर डाल दे इस बार अलाउड है बटर चिकन है ना 
Now, since this recipe, we have reviewed a lot of butter chicken recipes and this recipe doesn't use that much butter, which is fine, it's totally okay, but I would recommend using unsalted butter, not salted butter. If you use salted butter, you can't control how much salt that you actually add to this. And like always, it's a good idea to taste as you're cooking. So this is base gravy. Hmm? Once the base gravy is ready, we'll put our tandoori chicken into it. Bacha wa tandoori chicken jo na, wo isme dalenge. Ideally, purana tandoori chicken saute karke dala jata hai, fir wo dheere dheere gravy khichta hai aur interesting hota hai. But if you want to do a fresh chicken tikka, do a fresh tikka and then put it in it. But uh, classically, butter chicken was always a way of recycling. And salt. Now, like your friend V did, we added a little more water to this, as well as a little bit of salt. I didn't add as much as he did. The house has never smelled so fragrant. You can really smell the spices. So if you have a dinner party or a lot of people coming over, this would be a good idea to cook for them. Maybe double or triple the recipe because, you know, when people enter the house, they're gonna say, oh, wow, what did you make for us? It smells so nice. Butter chicken is not a historical dish considering Hindustan ki uh, jo, jo khani ki recorded history hai, wo char saal, char saal, saal purani hai. Butter chicken um, amuman kuch saath, sattar saal purana hai because ek to tomato bhoot deir se aaya. Aur uh, dousra butter chicken is a post partition dish, that's what they say. Uh, partition se kuch samay pehle se hi shuru hui. Aur kyunke uh, mild thi, to isliye wo chicken tikka masala ka roop leke uh, Britain pahunch gayi. But uh, it is a very recent dish in the Indian culinary history. And sometimes I feel very strange that this dish has so many years of our food history of the past 5,000 years of our food history. Now for everybody that loves Indian cuisine, let me know down below what your favorite dish is. Is it something like butter chicken, tikka masala, vindaloo? Do you like samosas? Do you like another type of curry? There are a lot of dishes, yeah? A lot. Too many to list off. Nice. So it's less than 15 minutes, huh? Because in 15 minutes, it will be warm with the tomato. And after that, it makes sense to blend. Now, like Chef Renvi has done, we have put a timer of 15 minutes on our butter chicken. And, well, for the next 15 minutes, you can do whatever you need. Maybe clean up a little bit and organize everything and relax. Now, the 15 minutes are up and we're going to do like Chef Renvi is doing. We're going to be blending our sauce into a fine little puree. You can use a blender if you have one at home, a Vitamix, a Thermomix, or any other type of brand that you have. Or you can use a hand blender. Now one little tip you don't need to do as I did, if your pan is a little wider and it's a little shallow, it is easier if you take this and actually put it in a deeper pot when you blend everything. Now let's put it in a Okay? No rocket science. Now as Chef Renvi is doing, we're going to be straining the sauce into another bowl with a little sieve. And I'm using a ladle since it's a little bit faster. You don't have to, but it helps. And like he is doing, we're also going to be tasting it. Well, I tasted it a little earlier as well but I'm gonna be tasting it again because whenever you make something, especially when you make something for the first time and you need to adjust the ingredients, maybe a little bit, it's a good idea to taste. Otherwise, you won't know what you need to adjust and fix. It's a good beginning, good beginning. But the story is only starting. How do you say that the sound is good? If the sound is good, the sound is good. Butter. बटर में जैसे मेल्ट हो जाएगा वैसे हम शुरू करेंगे अपना प्रोग्राम चिली लिटिल बिट ऑफ कोरिएंडर हल्का सा उसको बस ऐसे उफान देके नो यू डोंट हैव टू सोते द चिली एंड द कोरिएंडर पाउडर फर्स्ट इफ यू डोंट वांट टू बट it does help to bring out more of the flavors. We're gonna be adding our sauce into this mix just like he did. And of course, we're going to be adding a little bit of cream. Again, taste it and if it is a little too spicy, you may need to add a little more cream than what the recipe calls for. I'm obviously on the shahed side of things. And also, if you want to make it a little sweeter, then you can add a little more honey or a little sugar to it as well. Again, a lot of people will put chicken tikka, but actually, bacha wa tandoori chicken 
इसको बस श्रेड करके ऐसे करके डालना है इसमें जस्ट श्रेडेड तंदूरी चिकन दिस स्मेल सो गुड आ लेट नहीं नहीं मैं अपनी तारीफ नहीं कर रहा हूँ वाकई वाकई अच्छी है Now before this video I defrosted a lot of little chicken wings and drums that I had left over from all the chickens that I had cut up from well for using for stock. Then again I do like chicken wings so when I have a lot I make some chicken wings and I need to make another recipe. I have one but I need to make another one they're delicious. But in any case earlier I pre-prepped the chicken with some different spices and herbs and a little bit of yogurt. Baked them in the oven until they were finished. Chilled them, and well, I'm just picking them apart for this butter chicken as Chef Randy is doing. In any case, I wish all of you could actually smell what my house smells like right now because it smells like spices. Ah, जो ये मेरा तरीका है, ये शायद गुलाम सूल का तरीका है। मैंने काजू हटा दिया उसमें। लेकिन उसमें सबसे इंटरेस्टिंग पार्ट जो वो करते थे, वो बिल्कुल गिन के एक बूंद, एक बूंद बस ये, just one drop केवड़ा डाल तो इससे क्या है ना कि केवड़े की कोई खुशबू नहीं आती लेकिन द फ्लेवर्स गेट राउंडेड अप सो जस्ट वन ड्रॉप इन लाइक थ्री पोर्शन दैट्स ऑल क्विक चीट ना आफ्टर मैट दैट जस्ट टू मेक दिस रेसिपी आई बॉट a lot of spices and i bought some kira water as well and i've never used this ingredient before so this was a new thing for me and it has a very distinctive aroma to it very distinctive and like chef ranveer was doing we've only added Two drops to this recipe, and it does affect it. Bas, look at the shine now. Beautiful. One last taste. Very nice. Kasuri methi, toasted kasuri methi. And earlier, we also toasted some of the fenugreek that we were using today. Get a pan, heat it up. Add a little bit of the fenugreek leaves to that, and once they start turning a little brown, turn it on low heat, and that's it. Let them cool down and nice and toasty. Now, dried fenugreek does have a distinctive smell to it. It's a little hard to describe, but it does change. And actually, when you toast them, it does enhance the flavor as well. So if you don't do this, try it, and you'll see a difference. And we are done. Was one thing there because butter chicken, which is made from tandoori chicken, is made, right? तो उसमें तंदूरी नेस होती है मतलब उसमें वो धुएं की खुशबू होती है यहाँ पे वो धुएं की खुशबू है नहीं बिकॉज हमने अवन वाले तंदूरी चिकन से बनाया सो इन द एंड इसको बस वो धुएं की खुशबू देके और ढक्कन इसका बंद कर देंगे Now for anybody wondering at home if you need to go through this step or not it's not mandatory you don't have to do it but it is one of these steps that just adds a little more to it Now since I live in an apartment I don't have a fireplace and well it makes things a little difficult if I want to use some firewood some coal and everything else but in any case I went to the store I got some applewood chips applewood does have a nice smell to it and since it wouldn't start I decided to just stick one on the gas burner light it up and well if the neighbors complain so be it it doesn't really matter after I burnt the wood a little bit I put that inside put the lid on top and after a few minutes it smells delicious and I'm sure the neighbors are going to be knocking on the door pretty soon kya na wo punjabi bana pura nahi hoga to dhaniya nahi dalunga धनिया डाल देता हूँ डन है जी ठीक है ना जी तो मैं जा रहा हूँ मेरे बटर चिकन डिनर का टाइम हो गया यू इंजॉय इंजॉय मतलब बना के इंजॉय करोगे आप नहीं ओह वेरी नाइस इवन नाउ दैट आई हैव टू पुट सब टाइटल्स टू बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड शेफ अनवीज वीडियोस I enjoy them a lot. I really do. Now today we're going to play a little like he did. We're going to put a little bit of the butter chicken in a little bowl. I'm going to add a little bit of cream to this, not that much, and a little bit of fresh coriander. Time for the final taste. This is a delicious recipe, and I mean like delicious. A couple little tips when you're making this. Now since this recipe doesn't have any cashews, cashews are very oily. They help to emulsify the sauce. And since it doesn't have any, the sauce at the end may be a little thin. If it is a little thin, you can add a little extra butter to help thicken the sauce to make it a little well creamier. Also, if anybody else is eating this with you and they can't take that spiciness, you may have to reduce that spiciness. So either one, you can add more butter, which will increase the volume, add fat, cream to it, or add a little bit of cream as well. 
it will dilute the sauce a little bit, all of the spices and the flavors. So, you know, you need to balance that out. If you have tried this recipe, guys, then let me know down in the comments below if you have. And also let me know if you would change anything as well. But to be honest, this is a delicious recipe. I am definitely going to be making more recipes from Chef Renvi. Hopefully all of you did enjoy this video. This is the second cooking reaction video that we've done and we will be making more soon. And I know one day we're gonna have to try Jamie's butter chicken or his kind of butter chicken. Um, maybe not yet, but in any case, I know we will have to do that, but hopefully you did enjoy it. And well guys, be sure to check out this next video coming up here. Check out the rest of my other videos as well. If you haven't seen my knife videos or my other cooking videos and until next time, take care. I will see you guys again very soon. Bye. I'm